He was on the big blind. Nah, fuck that. Could easily have a two or a ten or uh, whatever crap he has. If it was against you, I'd probably call. Yeah, fuck it. Might as well save the chips, even though I was getting pretty good odds to call. There's no point calling if I think I'm losing. Everything kind of pointed to that. He bets. He calls. I call. Another card comes. He bets again. He folds. I call. And he bets again. I could have probably raised it if he had a 2. He might have even had a 10. I don't know. He's either got a 10 or a 2, and I can fuck about raising him, but... He might not even fold. If he's got the 10, he's not going to fold. If he had the 10, maybe I should have raised it. But If I hit the jack, I take everything off him. Let's think of it that way. If I hit the jack, everything's mine. <coughs> I didn't hit the jack. So I'll let it go. I think that's a good way of looking at it. Rather than, oh, if you risk your whole fucking tournament, he might fold them twos. I'd rather look at it, if I hit the jack, he's mine. If I miss the jack, I'm not going to risk on a bluff. That sounds like a good idea. Maybe I could have got him to fold, but I didn't know if he had a two or a ten. Best thing he has is eights or nines. That's the best thing he has. Eights or nines. But with two callers, I don't think he'd be stupid enough to keep betting like that if he's only got eights or nines. Maybe he even had a... Hmm. It was strange the way he was betting, though. It just looked like bet, bet, bet. Maybe aces. Could have been aces. I don't give a fuck what's on the board. I have aces. Bleh. Bleh. La da da. The blinds went up. Looks like they're going up five ten. That's how they do them. They do fifteen thirty, then they do. Do they do twenty forty? I think they do. No, it's ten twenty. Then it's fifteen thirty. Then it's twenty forty. Then it's 25.50. Yeah, so small blind goes up 5, big blind goes up 10, it looks like. The fuck am I on about? <laughs> it's like, what is that? How are they doing it? It must be. It was at 25.50, and now it's at 30.60. So they must, yeah, they must be doing it like that. Slow moving blinds. Not just the usual double, 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 double. The next one would be 35.70. Or maybe they'll do it different. Maybe they'll do 40.80. Start increasing it. 10.20. Crap hand for me. The disconnect has caught someone, got it in its grasp, dragging it down. 
maybe he's just gone to make cupcakes. Let's see what these ones do. And he'll fold. You can have my blind for now. That's pretty. It, it is. It's the prettiest non-suited hand there is. It looks good. Yeah, I don't think there is a prettier one than 7-2 suited. I'm not being sarcastic. I do think it looks the best off suit. Suited, probably... Not probably the ugliest, but, but suited it looks. Un no, I mean off suit, it looks good. Seven two. Well, of diamonds and spades, it looks pretty nice. The seven and the two go together. They look like they match, like a matching couple. You gone all in with your king four again, have you? So with that one to do a minimum raise, you to push in. I'm guessing you've got at least jacks or a pocket pair. With you, I'm gonna say you've got at least twos. But I'll say top five, ten to ace, you got one of them. Or maybe even ace king. You got that crap, have you? Let's see. Be nice if someone calls, then I'll get to see what card you got. Oh, he's requested time. Oh, he has aces and you have queens. Let's watch you hit a queen. Oh, there's his queen. Bye, Mr. Races. Shit, it's sick. Ooh. Crawl. Sick. Crawl. Sick. So we got two things. Crawl and sick. Wonder what will be next. Disgusting. Ugh. <laughs> Crawl and sick. I'm interested to see what's next. Oh, luck. Okay, crawl, sick, luck. Crawl, sick, luck. And what comes after luck? Remorse. Oh. Crawl sick luck we've got so far. Oh, yup. Crawl sick luck, yup. Crawl sick yuck, yup. Crawl sick luck, yup. Crawl. Crawl sick luck, yup. Crawl sick luck, yup. What comes after yup? I don't know. Camel. <laughs> Crawl, sick, luck, yep, camel. What comes after camel? Anything? <laughs> I guess not. Doesn't happen all the time. I prefer a one word. It's nice to have just one word instead of a whole sentence. It doesn't make for a good reading, but okay, it doesn't happen all the time. Crawl, sick, luck, yep, camel, it doesn't happen all the time. That's a good way to write a book. Good way to write a poker book. Just come on here, read the one-liners, and then just write them down. Crawl. Here is poker in, in a thousand words. Number one, crawl. Number two, sick. Minus the C. Number three, yup. And, oh, there's one. There's another one. A lame -o. And then a ha-ha. Woohoo. I don't think it happens too much with poker stars. Doesn't seem that much different from the other ones I've played on. Although I was reading a while ago about how poker stars are so shit and how it's always lucking out. If that was true, I'd have gotten my fucking straight flushes in my five card draw a lot more than what I've gotten, which is none. Although I have come close.
think I'll toss this shit. Bet cool. I wonder what you called with. See how strong that guy bet. And he had a real shit hand, two pair. And that's why it's good to hit a good hand. Just be solid. <laughs> 